Hello, boys and germs. Oh, where's my mic at the back? It's miles away. Hello, boys and germs. This um, Commodore 1 to 8 disk drive is um, broken. So I'm going to take this apart. I'm going to have a look inside, see if I can do something about it, because there's something else I want to do with this um, Commodore 1 to 8. I could just choose another one, but no, I want this one to work. Um, incidentally, it's really mullering the disc. So I suspect the uh, carriage is knackered. Oh, look, it's the time in there. Zero o'clock. Um, I expect the um, clamping mechanism is knackered. I don't know. I don't really mess around with disc drives. But that's what I'm going to do. Um, there'll be a lot of pausing and jump cuts. I warn you. Well, that's better. The camera moved. It's there now. Looking in here. The lid off. So let's turn this on and see if anything makes any sense. Well, that was nice. So there's no disc in there to make the horrible noise. Let's, um... That sounds like, to me, it's dropped. Let's lift this head up. Hmm. So either that's getting pushed down too hard, or... Hmm. Interesting, actually. I think that's good noise. Hmm. I'm wondering if it's actually ripping properly. Comment below. I mean, obviously, I need to find a better disc than this. Yeah. Yeah, that's there's something a bit not right with this mechanism interesting let's do a um oh my keyboard is upside down this is gonna be fun oh f3 this directory ah right well um some clever bugger changed the id of this uh so that's running on id 9 so i'm gonna have to do keyboard maneuver it's here um low blah, 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 blah. come on i didn't like that okay maybe it's on comma 10 i don't know where i put this drive no nope, didn't like that 11 didn't like that so i suggest the drive is simply an error state low blah, 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 comma eight no no blah, 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 comma nine no Low, blah, 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 comma, 10. No, low, blah, blah, blah. Com oh, you can't see the screen. I'm doing really well. Right, okay, then comment below. I have no idea what's going on. Hmm. Do you know, I think it might actually just need a bit of lubrication. Because I managed to get that thing. I'll, I'll make sure I don't electrocute myself on a lean across there. The, yeah, the head's moving. And it's trying to find track zero or whatever it would be. And then it's peed off. And if you send another directory command to it, it just goes new. There we go. I'll do that. There we go. Yeah. Hmm. So I think what I'm going to have to do is take this out, give it a clean and uh, just lubricate it, check for any loose bearings and stuff, and maybe that'll be it. And all of that's going to happen off camera, because I'm not geared up to do stuff like this. It's chaos here, you know. But I definitely need to find a replacement medium. I mean, that is literally translucent there, isn't it? I think you can see through it. Yes, you can. So I think the heads will need cleaning at the very least. Oh, it's Billy Jump Cut. Right, just to prove taking the drive out. Um... That sounds fine. Oh, where's the locking mechanism? It's great that you don't have to use a screw to fit these. There was a drive back in the day where that required a screw, and it used to annoy me. But yeah, that's spinning. So the noise isn't that. I think the noise really is literally just the probably the state of these heads covered in. Yeah, that really does look like you're not going to see that, are you? Tilty, tilty pretty filthy in there 
Um, but yeah, I think I'm just going to give this a quick clean up, a bit of dry lubricant, which is uh, good stuff to have. Um, it's like WD-40, but uh, less wet. I'll give that a clean up, find another disc, and then put it back in, and then get on with the next bit. That's the plan. Right, um, WD-40 uh, anti-friction dry PTFE. That's what I use on my uh, milling machines and stuff. It's quite good. It goes on, evaporates really quick. Leaves a tiny, tiny residue. Doesn't leave it wet. Anyway, so clean the heads, which are a bit of a sod on these, but I've done that manually with some Pippa and some IPA. And um, the heads are now moving freer since I've lubricated the um, bar. And I've just noticed there's a second bar in there. Okay, well, let's give that a quick zap. Luckily, it's away from the head. Ooh, try not to get loads in there. Hmm. Ah, you have to unlock the thing. Right, that's that lubricated on that side a bit. Uh, so yeah, now the heads are pushed all the way back. If I turn it on, I suspect. Oh, it does. Yep. Oh, that well. So that sounded better. I know there's no disc in there, but that sounded better. Progress. Um, I've also found some discs. I've got a blank disc that I've just formatted in my Vic Twenty, the cool kids computer, and a disc with files on. But before I sacrifice a disc with files on, I um. Better mount this thing for a start. Why is that not going in there? What's the problem? What's the problem? Right, get in there. Oh, is that it then? Oh yeah, that's, that's basically it. Right, um, I need a knob. It's a knob. All right, that will hold the drive in well enough for what we're doing. So I'm going to put a formatted disc in power on and the drive should fail to well read the uh directory and then just stop and it did oh job done right so we do a directory f3 ah well it didn't read actually the disc appears to be turning but yeah that didn't oh no there we go lovely right so i'm going to load that program Let's, uh, uh, that isn't quite right, is it? Let's do one of those, do a directory. All right, okay. Well, let's go load, oh, no, deload. Oops. D load uh, star searching for anything and it's not doing it. Why is that then? Not a bean. Well, the good news is there's no damage on that new disc, it's not ruined it. So let's try a disc that's probably C64. That made a bit more of a noise, didn't it? All oh, right, well, it read that. Reading's a good start. But what's better is loading. So, apparently that's got a boot menu. Hmm. Didn't make, I'm wondering if this machine's got an I.O. problem. Well, let's do the ultimate test, right? Yes. Oh, ah, now, I suspect this machine is broken then, if it won't go 64. Well, this was a fruitless video, wasn't it? Go 64, yes. Oh, that's doing it. And whoop, there we go, that's good. Low, blah, 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 comma, eight. Nothing. Low, blah, 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 comma, nine. Nothing. Low, blah, 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 comma, nine. Low, blah, 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 comma, eight. 
they are, I've got two devices on the same ID. That's what the problem is here, you know. Um, low, blah, 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 comma, uh, nine. Low, blah, 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 comma, ten. Low, blah, 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 comma, eleven. Hmm. Okay. Answer on a postcard. Eject that. Yank out the SD2 IC, which is supposed to be on a different ID. Clearly isn't. Let's try this again. Low, blah, 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 comma, eight. There we go. Oh, far not found. Well, that's something. Right again. Right out of error state. All right. Okay. Low blah 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 comma eight. I'm gonna cough. <coughs> no, it's not Happy Bunny. Check for disc damage. Disc go down. All right. Okay, let's go back to a, a blank disc. Well, a recently formatted disc in my working drive. And if we, um, where's the reset button on these things? Somewhere down here. Isn't it? There it is. Back into 128 mode. Right. Okay. Directory. Well, at least it sounds better. Uh, let's see if we can just load. Error in line one. Ah, that's why. That line shouldn't be there. <clears throat> there we go. Run. Yay! Right, okay, so the disk drive's working. Wow, what, what a glorious video that wasn't. Um, let's let's do a fresh program though. Let's do um list and we're gonna go uh ten print uh Still just uh, the keyboard on a 128 is so good. Of course, we've got to do that. Right, okay, so a bit of a point in this video because you didn't see much, but basically noisy drive, um, a bit of dry lube. I took the circlip out and, and got the lube in the back of the um, tensioner sprinkle thing. That's the correct thing. Should really use. Um mini emu to do that yeah so he had a bit of oil in there and i cleaned the heads using a bit of bog of oh, um kitchen roll and some uh 80 percent ipa and there we go i mean obviously uh because this is a um 1571 i really need to check that both sides of the disc work properly and i will do that but i won't be doing that now anyway that's our video and there will be another app video shortly like and subscribe